Okay, hello dear friends. Here we have a couple of uh, interesting problems. So let's do this uh, number 16. If the measure of an angle is three times the measure of its sublimate, what is the measure of the angle? So we can <coughs> establish that uh, this angle is A. If the measure of an angle A is three times, so we first read up the relationship. The angle of A, the angle of A, we uh, we suppose it's the measure is a is a three times three times of what three times the measure of its a supplement and the supplement of a is 180 minus a right the supplement of such angle is 180 uh, minus a because angle and its supplement makes up 180. So it's A equal 540 minus um, 3 A. Oh, sorry. I wrote it wrong. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. So A equal 540 minus 3 A and 4 A equals, you can move this one uh, <coughs> move this one to the other side of the equation and uh, change the change the direction or change the positive multiple of the sign. So 4a equals 540 degree a equal 1 um, 35 degree 135. So let's uh, let's just uh, prove, uh, check if it is wrong. So we have an angle around 145 degree, right? This is 180, and this one is 135. If I say something wrong, please excuse me. I mean 135. And this is the angle A, and its supplement is 180 minus 135 equals 45. And 45 times 3 equals 135. It proves that uh, they are wrong. Okay, now we move on to number 70. The measure of an angle is 24 more than the measure of its supplement. Find the measure of both angles. So <coughs> we establish the angle is A. The measure of an angle is A. measure of an angle is A and its supplement will be 180 minus A, right? And what is the relationship we have here? A and 180. The measure of an angle is 24 more than the measure of its supplement. So A equal 24 plus 180 minus A. So <coughs> um, a equal 204 minus A. 2A equals 204. A equals 100 and uh, zero, 10, uh, 102. So let's make it right around 102 
this one is A, one hundred zero two, and this one will be <coughs> uh, one hundred eighty minus one hundred zero two, which is um, is the bar is the bar uh, uh, bar. So this one. <coughs> So its supplement is seventy eight. Does it make sense? Seventy eight, seventy eight plus twenty four equals one hundred two. Right? It's proof that we are right. I think we are always the best to solve those problems. Okay, I like to do something with this calculation. If in a plane, if in a plane, PAD, BAC, B, A, B is 65 degree around here. We will not make it just perfectly right. B A D is sixty five, and D A C is thirty two. B A C thirty two. C here is thirty two. Okay, what is the measure of C A D? Right, this is the question. In a plane, uh, the measure of BAD is 65. BAD is 65. And uh, the measure of BAC is 32. What is the measure of uh, CAB? So we can just add up 32 plus 65 equals to 97. This is one way. We can do it another way, actually. So here we have B, A, D, and we put this angle, D, A, C, inside. D, A, C. C here, inside this one. So the big angle, concluding angle is 65 degree and we know um, DAC the small angle is 32 so now we want to know CAB that is 65 minus 32 which equals 33 degree so for this one we have two solutions one is 32 uh, 33 and another one is 97 um, <coughs> you can put the angle inside or outside each other make sense 